777 Enoch here coming back with another video alright so I want to talk about how to deal with gang stalking first do not pay it any attention mind your business you do not have to think of it as game stalking or being a targeted individual you don't it's literally just words frequencies frictions vibration energy that's all it is at the end of the day it is just good and evil yin and yang so don't pay it any mind the more you feed into it and I'm starting to realize that is the more that it will affect you so we know this is going on but we can't let this bring us down because we are chosen other examples would be to have support you know um it don't have to be a lot of people a huge group it could be just one person your friend um, if you trust anyone at this point, or just, you know, anyone that's genuine, um, it don't have to be your girlfriend or your boyfriend. What you want to do is just have someone to communicate with throughout the day, send them a text, you know, and what that is doing is it's helping you cope with the situation and it is helping time go by. So, let's just say that you got into a bad situation and you have nobody to talk to. When you text this particular person, you are going to feel a lot better than you would have if you didn't have anyone to talk to. Pay attention. Keep money on you um i know it's hard probably to get a job if you are targeted at this point um they may have set you up and you've been incarcerated you know so if you're just getting out it'll be hard for you to get a job or income but if you can you know just save up any type of money that you can get and put it to the side and what this will do is it will make you have stability you know so if anything bad was to happen you will be able to rise above all of that you will be able to make it through any bad situation if you got put out you will be able to get a hotel, um, pay to stay at a friend's house for a couple weeks or so. So, they do not like you, the demons. They do not like you with any type of income. Um, they hate that. If you are targeted and you are out in the public, you pull out a whole lot of cash and the demon is right there in front of you, they is going to feel very jealous. And they will become quiet. You know, so I noticed this. It works every time. So the whole, the whole thing is, is to make you lose everything. You know, so you want to think ahead of all that. The next thing would be to just don't feed into it. You know, if if you got certain people that surround you, um, 
you know, people that set you up or whatever like that, just don't feed into it. You know, if you have to just, you know, stay by yourself and make your own moves and do everything by yourself um, day to day, so be it. You know, you do not want to give them any more of your time or your energy because that is helping them and they are not looking out for you. They are trying to destroy you. So you have to remember that. So start giving these demons your energy. And that's something that I'm learning as I go. But I realize that now. So it's making me more aware and more powerful. So that's that. Stay off social media if you can. Um, being on Facebook, you know, I was set up way before then. I was put on the list way before then. But um, being on Facebook, posting all that stuff is not going to help you. Um, it's actually making it worse. And you're helping them, you know um predict your death so i don't even want to talk about death but um if you are still you know just being rebellious you know you can like you can make your own youtube channel like i got but if you are still on these um social media sites and you know it's ran by the feds and whoever like that's all it is at the end of the day is to incriminate yourself like you want to get from off that shit and, you know, find something else um, to, you know, reach the masses. Because um, that's helping them, you know, have every little thing, your location and everything. So, just, if you have a phone, like, just learn how to put your phone down. We have to get back to nature anyways. You know, you don't want to be in the house all day anyways. You're not getting no sunlight. You know, it's making you devolve. It's um taking away your evolution. It's keeping you trapped, you know, with your thinking. So you want to be able to get outside, turn off your phone. You know, if you have a friend or something, like, chill with them. You know, um, get sunlight. Like, that'll help you, too. Um, try to stay busy. Try to stay busy um, day to day. Um, don't lay down all day. Don't be in the house all day. That's what they like. Um, they want you to be scared to come outside. They want you to be scared to walk down the street. So you do not want that to happen. And um, just try to find any little thing to do. It don't have to cost money. So that will help you out with dealing with gang stalking as well. So I found that out too. Um, what else? If you are out and about you shopping or something and someone is harassing you or whatever like i ain't gonna lie like they got me a few times and like i was kind of scared the first time even though even though i say that i'm not scared you know it just if something happens to anybody out the blue light you're going to get shot when it first happened but um, i'm dealing with it now and what you can do is just do not pay them any attention and if they are watching you, like, you do not even have to make them know that they exist. Like, you can go the other way. Um, That's all they want. It's you to see them so they can cause fear and order out of chaos. Um, You get mad and you incriminate yourself. So, um, you got to understand that as well. But that's pretty much it. You know, just know everything is all right. You do not even have to consider yourself as a TI or a targeted individual. You know, you can just see it as just good and evil, angels and demons.